Greetings, Twin Flames. This is Lucida of Twin Flame RX, and I'm here on Friday, February 23rd, 2018, with some daily inspiration for you and a weekend reading for Twin Flames. So I'm going to start off the reading by reading this positive affirmation, reading the Rider Waite Tarot, and then reading some cards that I prayed over, meditated over, and then shuffled and drew with divine guidance for this weekend. But first, before we start that, I want to tell you about a new platform that I am doing readings on. It is called the Instant Go app. So this is my profile on the app. If you download it, it's only available right now for iPhones, iPads. I'm not sure about Mac, but it is an Apple product. So you can download this app. And then you can connect to my profile. It's Lucida, L-U-C-I-D-A, um, or Twin Flame RX. So this is my profile. I put a video, a recent video from the YouTube channel. And I try to answer your questions within 24 hours, so please be patient. I am in the U.S., and I am generally taking readings requests on this app. Um, between about 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. Central Standard Time. So if you want to download the app, instantgo.com, and look me up, it's Lucida. I also have the information on how to get in touch with me in the description box below. You can chat with me and get your questions answered quickly. So basically, if you look me up on the app, I'll come up on the top, and there are different ways to contact me. So we can do a voice call, a video call, or a message. So the 777 message is actually you sending me 160 characters. So every time you send me 160 characters in your question, you get charged 777. So I did a reading with someone at that rate the other day, and she got all her questions answered for under $15. So I just wanted to let you know that this is available to you, um, another way to connect with me. So check it out if you can. So now let's get started with the reading. We're going to get started with this affirmation from the Angel Affirmation Calendar by Doreen Virtue, where today it says, Thank you, God, for purifying our thoughts, feelings, and actions so that they are of the highest vibrational level of divine love and wisdom. So if we take that into the weekend, we will always be thinking positively and remember positive thoughts attract positive things to you. I have the writer weights row here. I'm going to shuffle. We'll get a bottom of the deck energy. I'm just going to draw one card for each twin. So the divine masculine twin, the divine feminine twin, and then the beloved, well, and then the union, kind of like a connecting energy between the two. Uh, we'll see what that shows us, the kind of energies we have going into this upcoming weekend, which is the 23rd through the 25th. I'll also be putting out a weekly reading. Most likely we'll be recording that tomorrow or Sunday. All right, so one more shuffle, and then we'll look at the bottom of the deck energy. Okay, bottom of the deck energy is that of strength. So both twins going into the weekend are realizing that they are stronger than they know. So you may be feeling pretty strong going into the weekend. So does your beloved. The bond between you, it never goes away. It can only become more strengthened. So if you're ever doubting the connection you have with your beloved, you can strengthen that connection by going into the fifth dimension in prayer, meditation, just in deep thought. And in the dream space, you can reach your twin in the astral plane and you can stabilize that connection with them spiritually. Okay, so we're going to cut the deck into three, divine masculine, divine feminine, and then union energy in the center. And we're just going to pick one card from the top for each polarity. So the divine masculine energy for this weekend is that of temperance. So they're going into the weekend feeling pretty balanced when it comes to their beloved twin flame. So there's energy that's exchanged between 
the divine masculine and the divine feminine. And it's an equal exchange. It's temperate. That means that there's a balance going on there. And also the divine masculine may be realizing in the 3D that they need to take more temperate actions, that they need to dip their toe into the water possibly to see if it's a good time to connect with their beloved. Or they may start to do things more in moderation, like if they have any bad habits, they might start realizing that those bad habits are excesses and that they need to temper down their drinking or overeating or overspending or spending time with the wrong people and pretty much start detoxing their life so they become more in balance and therefore they can join their beloved in bliss. And for the Divine Feminine, we have the Ace of Pentacles here. So this is a really positive energy as well. This is a new beginning in the physical. This is saying the Divine Feminine is using their time and energy wisely, that they are investing their hard-earned money, time, and energy into something that is going to bring a new beginning for them. So whatever it might be, you might be investing time on yourself, self-care. You might be investing time and energy into your mission, and that's beautiful, and that will bring fruits, and that will bring you closer to your beloved because you're going to stabilize. And there's definitely a lot going on behind this um, threshold here, and you are embarking, Divine Feminine, if you're watching, on this new beginning this weekend. So that's a great energy to be in. For the union, what kind of energy do we have for both twins? Wow. So we have really good energies here. We have divine feminine, new beginnings in the 3D. Divine masculine is learning to balance out energy, learning about giving and receiving, balancing out their divine feminine and masculine aspects. But then for the union, we have more balance. So we have an equal give and take between the two twins. We have the scales of balance here with the six of pentacles that you know, one person is not going to be giving more to the other than the other is giving. So both of the beloveds are going to be realizing that if they want a good relationship between each other in this physical realm, physical because of the coins, they need to give and receive their energy with each other in a balanced way. So one twin might be used to being the chaser kind of where they're constantly going after their twin, well, they're going to pull back enough that their twin can reciprocate. So there's going to be a reciprocal, a balanced exchange of energy between the twins this weekend. And it looks like it could be more of a physical manifestation of that. So in the physical realm, there might be some action. There might be some messages exchanged. It may not be exactly what you want it to be, but make sure it is balanced. That is the key for this weekend and keep it positive as well. Awesome energies. So we are going to now look at a message from your beloved using this Lover's Oracle by Tony Carmine Salerno. Beautiful image here with the lotus blossoming. We have a rainbow in the background. We have, looks like a sun there shining brightly on this divine feminine. And the message is freedom. There is nothing stopping you. The path is clear if you want it to be. So your beloved is letting you know that maybe they have stepped back from the connection a bit to give you some freedom. Maybe they want you to know that love is freedom. Maybe they want you to know that there are really no obstacles between the both of you. The path is clear if you want it to be. So believe that the path between yourself and your beloved is clear and it will be. Miracles Now card by Gabriel Bernstein is telling us this message. When we move our bodies, we bust through all that blocks us from our true health and vitality. So the message for this weekend is keep it moving. So to move around. When you move, when you exercise, when you take a walk in nature, when you just get up from sitting or when you just do anything that involves movement, yoga, stretching, anything, you are moving energy around your body and that's also helping you to release blockages. So whenever you feel that things aren't going your way, take a walk. It'll move the energy around. It'll help you. It'll help you create miracles in your dynamic between yourself and your beloved. We also have the Kuan Yin Oracle message and the Archangel Michael. So I wanted to have a balanced perspective between divine feminine and masculine energies. So the Divine Feminine Energy with the Kuan Yin Alana Fairchild Oracle here is Mother of Mercy. 
It says, Dispensations of mercy come when we are without recourse, ending a cycle of manipulation, unkindness, or unconsciousness. This spiritual assistance is offered to you now from a place of loving respect, kindness, and great spiritual power. Blessings to Kuan Yin, Mother of Mercy, who watches over us with attentive love and cares for our spiritual progress. So what this message is, is that we need to break the cycle of being a manipulator and being unkind or unconscious. When we do that for ourselves, we also free that energy up for our beloved to follow suit, and that will help us to get into her harmonious balance with our beloved. Archangel Michael's message for us is guarded and protected. So he's letting us know that our unions are guarded and protected. No matter what 3D threats may come to them, there's always that 5D protection. In higher dimensions, the archangels are protecting us. So let's end this by thanking Archangel Michael for protecting our beloved and us in our union and ensuring that we're safe and that all of our needs are met. We now accept Archangel Michael's help gratefully and gracefully, knowing that it's right for us and all others to accept heavenly assistance, especially at this time for our Twin Flame Union. And as we end this, I just noticed the 1111 on the clock as I was wanting to send you some Reiki healing energy so that you know that your divine union is balanced, protected, Basically, whatever you want your union to be, say that it's so and it will be so this weekend. So I'm sending you that declaration that your physical union is here. Many blessings. Namaste.